Hello friends, while you are doing an important work, if you want to control your electronic appliances, food switches are far away from you, then every time you will go there and turn on or off switches, it's an irritating process. To raise a wall against these type of irritating works, we all will need a smart gadget. So in this video, we will learn how to make smart switchboard. Hardware components required for this project are Node MCU board or ESP 12V module, 4 channel relay board, jumper wires, switches and sockets, 8 way gang box. Software required for this project are Arduino IDE software, Enric account, Alexa app, Alexa device. I have given links for all the products, the complete code for this project, the circuit diagram, the details of software setup, Enric account setup, the process of complete coding and finally Alexa device setup with the smart switchboard that we have made in the document that I have provided. Our smart switchboard looks like this. Now coming to its features, you can control it in three ways. One, with your voice commands, just like turn on switch one to turn on first switch. Two, from your Alexa app in devices section from anywhere in the world if internet connection is present. Three, whether the internet connection is alive or not, it doesn't matter. You can control the appliances with switches on the smart switchboard at any time. Let us see the way of operation of this smart switchboard. These are the connections, how you should do. Please look at these connections. I have provided the circuit diagram code in the document that I have given. Now let us see how it works when I say Alexa, turn on all switches. Okay. Turn off all switches. Okay. You can also control it manually with switches. Alexa, turn on TV. Okay. To turn off the to turn off the TV at this position with manual switches, just turn on the TV switch and turn off the TV switch. In this way, you can control with manual switches. You can also get the real-time feedback in your Alexa app, whatever it is in PC, laptop, or even mobile phone. You can control it from anywhere on the app if your internet connection is alive. If internet connection is not provided, then you can control it with manual switches which are provided on the switchboard. I have used Node MCU CP2102 board here. You can also use ESP 12V module which is cheaper than the Node MCU board. Uh, you have to use a 3.3 volt regulator to power supply this board, otherwise it will burn out. Mind it, use 3.3 volt voltage regulator. After the assembly, our smart switchboard will appear like this. You can hear that cycle sound. Alexa, TV on. Okay. Table fan on. Okay. Table fan off. Okay. Home theater on. Okay. Turn off all switches. Okay. The smart switch board. Now I am turning on the switches manually. You can see. Now I am turning off the switch. All switches works. You can see the devices get it on. Now I am turning off all the switches. You can also get the real time feedback of the switches. This is the switch of the TV, you can see, here, the switch is on, it's indicating, the device is also get on, you can see, so I am turning off the switch, you can see the real time feedback that the switch is off, okay, you can also get the real time feedback when saying Alexa, TV on, okay, okay, Alexa, sorry, TV off, okay, Okay, 